welcome back to another. Let's build new crest. <laughs> well, <laughs> I just had to literally bite my face to stop myself from laughing at that part. Thank goodness for text to speech. That's all I can say. Um, I've got to hear that one more time. I'm sorry, but... Hello, everyone. <laughs> Welcome back to another. Let's build new crest. <laughs> I'm going to have some fun with that site, I can feel, because there are plenty of other voices that we can choose from. What about if I do like a whole Let's Build episode and just text to speech? <laughs> oh, that could be funny. I'm probably peeking my mic, aren't I? Well, here we are. Back in to Higginbottom House, my loves. We are here. We are here. We have done the basement of debauchery. We've still got to do a little bit today. We've still got to... I have sorted out the cinema room now. I've made it darker. This is one of your guys' ideas. Putting like a full curtain here. So they still can walk through, but they've still got their own little private moments. They may not have in front, though I will say that, but... This, ha this place is full of debauchery, so I'm just saying they'll be okay. Now, I have had the first party in here. Um, We got the group. The group is together. They've had their drinks. There's two there. They are spoiled. <laughs> they are spoiled. Um, The only thing that didn't work with the club, and I was quite annoyed about it, is the fact that they didn't change into the outfits that I picked out for them. Um, yeah, I was a little bit annoyed about that. A little bit annoyed about that. So today, we're going to be doing the bathroom. We're going to be doing the toilet down here. Um, I'm definitely going to be putting some portraits up of some rather suggestive content, shall we say. Um, I put a microphone down here because that it just needed to happen. Also changed the light just a little bit more red. Um, didn't really do too much. I was kind of happy with how it turned out. Thank you, as always, for all of your feedback. Am I, like, off to the... I'm not central, am I? Let me move myself. There we go. Very rude. Um, I've put a robot vacuum down here just to clean up any sticky substances. I'm a child. I know. I did furnish the other bedroom as well. What's pissing me off is that Eleanor keeps coming down with full on, um, autonomy on and trying to clean, like, pop, pop away these. She's trying to put them away. She's trying to hide her filth when it's out in plain view for everyone to see. Um, we've also got the butler as well. The butler has moved in. Mr. Edward Livingston is in the kitchen. Oh, and he's so, look at those pretty kind eyes. Oh, I do love him. Edward has moved in, my loves. He is here. He is cooking up some gourmet pet food for the four pooches. Um, he's just walked them. So they're probably all a bit knackered. I noticed that Pierce was here somewhere as well. Yeah, Pierce is here playing with the dogs. I think that is so cute. I... Uh, and that just happened naturally. He came and knocked on the door. Got a friendly with Eleanor. Eleanor was having a little chat with him. And he started petting all the dogs and stuff. And he's here playing with them now. And I just love that. I love that for him. Because he is—he does want a dog, doesn't he? So I just love that for him. But, yeah. So today we're, gonna, we're obviously going to be finishing off the basement. Then we're going to come up here. We're going to be doing Eleanor's sweet, my loves. And I completely forgot. You, you guys had to remind me. This is the dog be dog's bedroom. I c I'm very ashamed of myself that I did forget that. So we will be making that into a dog bedroom and not an office. Um, I'm probably going to put like the office in this area. Like maybe just put a nice desk here or here or something. Um, just so she has got somewhere where she can come and keep up to date with all of her finances. With the flower, the florist and whatnot. But yeah, I thought that would be pretty cool. Pretty cool indeed. Um... Yeah, let's get started. Let's get started. Absolutely, 100% pissing myself at all of your um, comments last time. Something stuck on my teeth. I hope I did not have a bit of spinach in my teeth for that whole intro. If I did, I apologise. It is not dirty. It is just a bit of spinach. Spinach. <laughs> Do I have my cheats on? No. Give me one second. <laughs> okay. Well, here we are. So, my thoughts were... Maybe putting two baths in here. 
It's just going to literally be a bathroom for baths and bathing and debauchery. So I'm thinking about putting just two really lovely freestanding, maybe black baths. We haven't got full black ones, have we? Do I? Is that a thing? No, I think they've all got the white. Oh, no, this one here. Oh, no, that's kind of copper. That's very pretty, actually. Such pretty bath, that is. Such a pretty, pretty bath. <laughs> um, I'm thinking about putting two in here. Maybe I could do like one there. Oh, that one's going to, it's going to have to face the other way though. I hate that they can only get in to the bath from one side. Is that a thing? We're going to test that. We'll test it. Testicles. <laughs> um, I can't help but say that. It's the gay in me. It just comes right out of filth and I'm just here for it, to be honest. Um, yeah, I'm thinking like this kind of moment. Maybe, is that equal there? I hope it is. Let's get that grid off. Uh, it's, I don't know if it's the right... Oh, I don't know if it's the right bath, though. I love this big hood at the back. I'd kill for a bath like that. I really would. Um, My bath's similar to this one, but in white. Um, I love it. I absolutely love it. I do. Um, Yeah, I'm thinking maybe them two, them. We'll stick with them. Nice big fireplace. We'll put some... It's got to have mirrors in here. It would be rude if we did not have a big full wall of mirrors so they could flash their pasties to each other from across the room <laughs> like smoke signals <laughs> but instead of smoke signals pasty signals <laughs> i have no idea what i'm saying <laughs> um and a nice rug maybe a shared rug in the middle a shared rug <laughs> shared carpet <laughs> oh i'm extra filth for today i do warn you I do warn you, I've had a day. It's been a nice day. It's not been a bad day. I finished painting the floorboards um, outside the, my office in the uh, kind of hallway going through to my office. Um, I've also, what else did I do? I tidied this spare bedroom because it was getting a mess and I, I'm a Virgo, I can't work properly knowing that my surrounding area is messy. Um, so I had to give it a good old clean. I also cleaned my gaming PC. It made it spick and span. So it is absolutely glorious now, my loves. Um, I think we'll get a bit of gold in here. Be oh, we have got copper in the baths, though. Eh! Oh, do you know what? We'll put a copper bloody mirror up instead. Fuck it. We'll have it. Copper mirror up there. Lovely. Lovely. And some romantic candles. Maybe we'll get rid of the chandelier and just have it lit by candles. Candles. <laughs> Why am I saying it like that? I don't know. Um, should we put these in here? I mean, we could. Oh, we could look. We could flop either of them up there. Oh, I love that. And maybe use those these ones here in the red, just down by the sides of the bath, my loves. I'm really hoping that they can get in this side of the bath but i don't think they can so it's just such that would be such an easy fix and it would make it would make sense wouldn't it it would make sense if they would do that i wish they would um the only thing here is the mirrors aren't central to the bath and that's kind of really bugging me and i bet you any money there's someone out there like <laughs> they are not central to the bath aiden i mean that's a bit better it's not perfect but it's better and we're gonna do it connecticut <laughs> it's that character from SNL with Kristen Wiig. She, I can't remember who she tries to do an impersonation of, but I always piss at myself at her impersonations of her. Down in Connecticut. She always shows her teeth. If someone knows who that is, let me know. I'd be very interested. Um, I'm going to flop one of these draperies, actually. Oh, will they catch on fire? Yes, I think they would. Maybe that's a bad idea. Maybe that is a bad idea in here. Well, that looks nice, doesn't it? In that colour. I think we'll do that. I will. I think we'll bloody do it. Okay, well, we've got that. I'm going to flop up on the wall here a couple of robes, just in case they do not want to flash around too much. They have got a little bit of privacy. Um, If I can find them, because I have got to show every bloody object in game cheat. <laughs> uh, I think they're base game, aren't they? Where are you, darlings? Don't hide from me. There we go. Found them. 
We'll flop a couple of them up. Just stop. Oh, is that a bit high? Is that a little bit high there? I think it's fine. It's fine. So there we go. Oh, that's a nice bathroom, actually. I do like that. Do you enjoy it? Yes. Yes, we used the tiles from um, Realm of Magic as well. I think they just suited it very nicely. Now, this would be one room where I do believe um, having your own space would be mandatory. <laughs> I can't see people getting... Well, I actually can. I was just about to say I can't see people getting off on the fact that people... But there are people out there like that, aren't they? Not kink shaping. You do what the hell you like. But for me and my gameplay... Not for here. That's just too much filth as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> um, we'll use the matching um, sink. Where are you? There you are. So yeah, we'll just keep this kind of simple, really. A little toilet just for them to relieve themselves in other ways, which is nice. Yeah. Yeah, nothing too, men nothing too maddening in here. We'll keep it quite low-key. Lovely little... Bit of that up there and we'll get a lovely little copper moment of you there my love stunning yeah and i'll do like a mirror here like a freestanding mirror i think um it needs to be quite elaborate oh maybe, no that's not giving me the vibe this one would yeah that would give me the vibe i want just in case you want to check yourself out and i'll put a little chair in this corner as well um we could bring in a red chair from out here couldn't we one of those yeah we can put that and i'll put it in that orientation hopefully they'll be able to use that sink can't see why not but i will shuffle it this way just in case along with you my love come here that should be all right if not they're just being fussy we're not for it let's move this along a little bit as well god if you were sat on that toilet you'd hit <laughs> You'd have a full view of yourself, wouldn't you? Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. That will do. Okay, the basement of debauchery is complete. We'll do... Oh, that window keeps doing that. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it at once. And um, we'll do something down there as well. I don't know what we're going to put out here just yet. Maybe an area where they could come out and smoke if they may wish. A little smoking area. But it does need to be kind of low-key, doesn't it? We don't want them... Um. We don't want them giving away all their secrets, do we? Okay, right, into Eleanor's bedroom. Not enjoying that. I need to pop you there. Into Eleanor's bedroom. Somebody said that these look like toenails and that is all I can see now. Ugh. Feet. Feet are not the one for me. Okay, so. Princess style. But still very elegant. and Very, maybe modern. No, maybe just a little bit more. Oh, I don't know. Maybe something a little bit more. Oh, that goes in here. Oh, I enjoy that. I'm thinking I actually I'm going to change these curtains for maybe the vintage glamour ones. No, I kind of like them, actually. I do kind of like them. Oh, one thing I did change as well. One of you guys pointed it, at, pointed it out was I was able to use this in its full size because I stupidly forgot we have got a foundation out here. So that wouldn't poke through the ceiling at any point. So yeah, we were, we managed to be able to use that in full size. Just thought I'd get that in. Why did I think that then? I think it's because I thought these were going into the ground and they're not. I don't think they are anyway. Yeah, I kind of like this. Kind of like the black. Let's start bringing in some darker aesthetic in here. Not too dark though. Just Just hints of it here and there, I think. Yeah, this is definitely the right bed for Eleanor. I'm feeling it. What about putting the bed on that wall, actually? Yes, that's much better. Um, okay, bedside tables. Um, again, we still want to keep it slightly contemporary. Oh, shit, I didn't change this door here. We did go for the more Georgian-looking doors. Love a Georgian door. Just reminds me of my best friend, Lee. Whenever we see a Georgian door. Look at that beautiful Georgian door. That Georgian door exquisite. <laughs> Love a Georgian door, me and leaders. <laughs> um, okay. So it needs to be semi contemporary, but not too it doesn't have to be too much contemporary. So maybe just something a little bit more classic looking, but still clean. 
Um, I mean, I mean, I don't. Oh, that's quite a nice little colorway in here, actually. Yeah, there we go. Stunning. Even though that is a block of apartments, we're going to move them in. Yes. And we'll get rid of these and I'm going to put lampshade on either one of these here. Um, I'm thinking about maybe doing a Tiffany lamp in here. Would that work? Mm, not really. And I don't think the lampshade color changes too well either. Just spat them. Do you excuse me? No. That's not the right one in here. It does need to be a little bit more contemporary. Really? Doesn't it? I don't think I'm going to use black though. Just little hints of black here and there. Yeah, I like them. Yeah, I do. I enjoy that. I do enjoy that. What's that creeping in there? What are you? Oh, you're a little leaf. Well, nobody in fucking invited you, did we? There we are. Um, I want some drapage up here. I don't think we've got anything that would drape over the bed in a manner that Eleanor would agree with. But we're going to try. Have we got a brighter one than that? We haven't, have we? I wish this came in a white. White. I just, I don't know. I can feel drapage. I can feel it. I can feel it in my very bing binging. I can feel it in my binging. Is how I decided to say that. Which is fantastic. <laughs> I mean... I wish that when you size them down, you could move these wherever you bloody like. I mean, that's a little bit too over the top anyway, to be honest. I mean, for goodness sake. These are all going to be very... Oh! Oh! It's going to do exactly the same, though. But I don't know why. I'm kind of there for that. It's making those curtains look weird now, though. I just want a little bit of extra va 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 voom, you know? And I just think that this will do it. What about if I can just delete this these walls just for the meantime? Whiffle this. Is that gonna can I get that any lower? No, I can't. Oh, okay. Well, forget I fucking said anything, to be honest. I am feeling that above the bed though. Some people out there are gonna be like, what? But I just want a little bit of drama. I just want some drama in Eleanor's room. Uh, <laughs> uh, I don't know. I think I might have to change these curtains for the vintage glamour ones now. Which I'm not mad at because I love them. I mean, not those ones though. Where are the plainer ones? Here they are. Like this. This. And this. Is that one up higher? It is. There we go. And this, this and this. There we go. There, that's better. That ties them in a little bit better. Yeah, I just want that. I want that little bit of drama up on the wall. I do. And I am. And you cannot stop me. <laughs> well, you probably could. You could probably say, like, Aiden, it looks hideous. How dare you? And to that, I would say, you are not my real mum. You know what I'm going to say. I'm that predictable <laughs> by now <laughs> um i just think it i could maybe put like a little crest of something there a little crest what about if i oh, yes i could put the uh the club thing there what let me oh, i need to filter it don't i filter it for get together and put the club logo there the club logo is that romantic one where are you there <gasps> I kind of liked it, like, behind the bed there. Oh, I like to see a little subtle nod to her dirty, lovely activities that she likes to get up to. I'm there for that. Yes, lovely. Okay, rug-wise. Let's maybe go a little bit abstract with the rug. So I'm going to filter the rugs to black, grey and white. Grey, white, black. There we go. And let's see what we've got. Just something a little bit abstract would be nice. Um, I think this might be a little bit more difficult than what I imagined. What about you? No, I want to go darker. Darker on the floor because we've got like really pale, scandy 
floorboards. And I just feel it would be better. Ooh, never seen that one before. Um, that's not too bad. That's a maybe. That's not giving me a massive vibe. But I'm kind of there for it. Kind of there for it. Not all the way there for it. Just kind of. Um, what about you as well? Let's have a look. Mm, no, that's a little bit too Ikea. And there's nothing wrong. I love Ikea. Love Ikea. Let me see you. Mm, that's a little bit too abstract for me. Just a little bit. Maybe, do you know what would probably be the best bet? But what would be safe? To use the big flat, the flat? The big fluffy rug, but do it in a grey. Like a dark grey. Oh, there we go. That's the one. Yes. That's the vibe. And I'm going to pull it right out because I do want to get a little seating moment in the front of this bed here. Using some furniture from Nestle to Laos. Yeah, maybe using some furniture from Nestle to Laos. Um, maybe this was his like, I don't know. Maybe he had an era where he went a little bit regal, but decided to. That's a bit too, yeah, that's a bit too, uh, that's not the vibe. It's sort of the vibe, but it's not. Maybe I could use these, actually, because we didn't get to use them in the other house. Maybe it would work well in Emerald's bedroom. Just a little bit more of a darker aesthetic in here, and I'm kind of here for it. I will not lie to you. I could use them in pure white. No, we definitely need to match in with those bedside tables. They did have that um, white and black. Where are you? Oh. Oh. <laughs> I thought I... Why did I imagine something that wasn't there? I imagined this being white with the black bit. Well, that's just kicked me in the tits and not in a good way. Oh, I'm going to find the perfect one because I don't think that's going to be the right one just yet. Okay, so we went with the vintage glamour. I wish this came in a love seat size. I wish it came in a smaller size. Um, and But I also used a divider just to separate the kind of sleeping area from her i don't know what you would call this like a living room bedroom <laughs> okay that's a great choice of words there aiden well done well done <laughs> um and i think maybe pulling up like mm, we need like a i mean that mm, i wish the lit i always say oh i forgot about that swatch that would work <gasps> Looks lovely. Oh, yes. Absolutely. Let's pop that one there. Just like so. And we'll do a little coffee table moment in the middle. Not a big one. Not a big one. Maybe actually using this one in the black. Just there. Oh, stunning. Yes. And do you know what's going to look lovely on there? That little lighting moment from Vintage Glamour as well. You know, with the tray on. Oh. I knew it would. Oh, yes. Just that pop of pink. Oh, she'd be absolutely feeling that. She definitely would. Yes, I like that. I think what we're going to do here is add in a nice spandrel. A spand spandrel of dreams. Maybe go for this one. Mm, no, I want something a little bit more elaborate. I think that's as elaborate as we're going to get, really, isn't it? And it's green for some reason. Uh, do you come in a dark? Oh, there we go. Oh, there we are. Yes, and we'll do two of the... Uh, I could probably use the... Um, these ones here up there. What, what is that called? The librarian pillar, did it just say? Yeah, the librarian's pillar. Oh, I didn't know you had that swatch, love. Oh, yes. Yes, that's definitely the one. I'm thinking about Art Decoing up a little mirror moment here now. So maybe we could use the... Um, where is it? I mean, it's not really Art Deco, but if I can maybe overlap them, it might help. I've done this before, but this may give me a vibe. Yeah, yeah, it does. Yeah, I enjoy that. I know it's not equal on either side 
So I will fix that before somebody pisses the knickers. <laughs> pisses the knickers. <laughs> Why am I laughing at my own jokes? Hmm? Tell me. Right, maybe I could put some... Oh, they don't come in a pure black and white. I'm always baffled by that. I'm always baffled by it. The yellow would look good as well. So maybe we'll pop a couple of them in there as well. Just to bring in that gold element again. Oh, yes. And then a couple of candles up here. It looks stunning. Oh, they would look good in there. Oh, they do. They absolutely do. I'm going to put another one of these chairs on this wall. Just for an extra moment. Because we all enjoy an extra moment, don't we? We certainly do. We certainly do. Yeah, I like that. That's very nice. That's giving me Eleanor vibes. It's a darker aesthetic to the rest of the house, but I'm kind of like, I love popping in the darks in this house. So you can see I've done it in a few of the places. So it's kind of marrying in well up here. So this is the dressing room. We're going to do maybe a walk-in. Oh, no, let's not do a walk-in wardrobe. Let's use, um, where are you? This one here, but bigger. Where are you? There you are. Do you come in? I think it, oh, it does indeed. Has it got a black and gold? Black and gold. That's too black and gold, though. Who sings the black and gold song? Is it Sam Sparrow? Did I just make up that word? That name? I have no idea. In fact, we're going to keep it in black and silver. I'm sorry, Sam Sparrow, but it's black and silver here, I'm afraid. <laughs> and I'm thinking maybe we could get in a bit more of a period element. One of Nestle Tullaus's, um furniture pieces from his Renaissance years. Um, yeah, I'm feeling this. Yes. Yeah, that would look good there. Just there. Absolutely, I love that. I do. And I'm thinking maybe putting a big bunch of flowers on top of that. From one of Eleanor's many admirers. Admirers, even. Um, where's that new one? Oh, let's get out the colours, my love. Let's get into packs. Uh... Yeah, what about this one? Do you come in a dark? Oh, you do. Oh, fantastic. Yes. Yes. Needs a candle up there, though. The lighting in here is a little bit off. Um, lighting. Um, one. Oh, not eco lifestyle, my dear. Just one of these little. Where are you? From Dine Out. Where are you? There you are. Yeah, I'll just whiffle one of them up there. Oh. Yeah, cute. I do think there needs to be a mirror behind this, actually. Just a nice moment behind here. And maybe I'll chuck in a bit more of that gold element into this bit here. Oh, yes, that's lovely. I do enjoy that. I do. We need a little pouffe sitting on this area. So I'm going to flop a poof in. <laughs> um, Maybe you. But we'll just skirt you off slightly. Oh, I knew that would happen. Yes, that's stunning. In fact, does it have that? It does have a black and white moment, doesn't it? Yeah, that's better. Just a little bit of pattern, a little bit of texture. Yeah, I enjoy that. I'm keeping this area free because I want to get a mirror in this part. Maybe. I don't know if it would work, but maybe if I use the screen in here. In a... In a... Oh, a grey then. <laughs> I think it would work, actually. Kind of fills up that space nicely as well. Yeah, yeah, I'm happy with that. Is that the right orientation? I think it needs to be just in a little bit further into there. Have a look at you. Yeah, that's perfect. Oh, yes. Yes, indeed. And I think we'll just put a nice dresser here. We'll probably, in fact, we'll probably, oh, it being in this room, though, I think we need to use a bit more of a dresser that would fit in with the aesthetics in this particular part of the room. So maybe, um... What do you look like? No. Definitely not you. Jeff, I mean, this one would work well in here, wouldn't it? Yes, it would. So we're doing it. Do you have a better tone? Can we chuck a bit more gold over this way? We certainly can. Can I do two of them? No. It's not going to fit in, is it, if I wanted two? Let's have a look. No, that's a shame. That would look stunning with two. Oh, well. Um, I'll just do one. Doesn't really matter, to be honest. Doesn't really matter. I do a little dresser there. 
Yes, that's lovely. And then we'll do a nice mirror. What mirror did I use up there? I used that one. So what mirror came with Eco Lifestyle again? That's the ticket. Right there. Can, do you, have you got a black frame? That's not black. Yes, it does. So maybe I could do like a little moment like this. In the words of Leona Lewis and Kelly Clarkson, a moment like this. Yes, that's giving me a bit more Art Deco vibes as well. Just pull that out slightly. Yes, Queen. Yeah, I'm kind of here for that. I am going to move this one and pop them on either side there, though. The toenails of love. <laughs> the toenails of love. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, And I'm thinking maybe shif shuffling one more of these chairs into this corner. Maybe here, actually. And then I can do a little table here. A little... Ooh. In fact, a bookshelf would look good in this room, wouldn't it? Yes, I'm thinking a bookshelf. Let's have a little look at what bookshelf we could squeeze into this part. Um, I'm thinking I could maybe not use the bookshelf, actually. Use that new shelving system that came with a new pack in a really dark, if you would. And I could put that here. And then put that there. Definitely need another sconce over here. Up there. Yes, I'm thinking that's going to work quite nicely. I am going to shuffle this even closer this way, though, I think. Just to give a bit more space. Yeah, I like that. I'm not liking how... Do you know what would work better here? I love this. I do want to use this. I do. In fact, I could. I could get rid of you. Shuffle you along to there. Oh, I love being able to do that. It's a game changer. And then whiffle that into the corner there. And I could use those mirrors over there, couldn't I? There we go. We'll just flop them in like that for the meantime. And then I'll whiffle them together there we are oh don't like that gap that crevice <laughs> don't like that crevice right if i can and then pull you out a little bit more um no that's a lot going on there that's a shame maybe i can just stick to using that there though yeah we'll stick to using that there and i'll plonk some stuff on here here uh i would definitely be putting a little makeup area for her i think that would suit her to the ground do we want to do it in a white or a black i think we need to pour a bit more black over this side so we'll do it we'll do it and then i'll use a lovely chair where am i going to find these chairs there we go um i'm thinking using the yeah maybe this one actually yeah, yeah, that one would work well. Is that white and black? No, it's not. Damn. Oh, actually, I could use the vintage glamour one, couldn't I? It always goes well with that desk, and it's got a white and black. Well, light and black. Yeah, I'm for that. I very much am. I'll get out that uh, little makeup moment that we've got. It's in clutter, Aiden. I was just checking the timing then just to see I'm not babbling on for too long, knowing we've got other rooms to do. Don't worry, I'm not rushing. I won't rush a thing. Um, There we go. In the blank. Lovely. Stunning. Oh, yes. And then we'll get... Oh, that object would look really good over here as well. I'm not moving it from there, though, because I enjoy it. So we'll put up a little tea light instead. A little tea light and maybe a couple of plants either side here. Just some tall boys like this one. Yeah, we'll do that there. And we'll whiffle that one around as well. Oh, bugger. We'll just save it while we're here. We may as well. Um. Yeah. Yes, I enjoy it. I do. I'm thinking here. I'll put up a clock. Uh, like the vintage -y one like this. 
Oh, yes. Oh, definitely. Eleanor is going to be very pleased with that room. She very much is. I'm here for it. Okay, so dog's bedroom. The only problem is I tried to, when I was player testing this, I couldn't use all four in here because they just wouldn't use them. They couldn't get past to like get their food and stuff. So I had to get rid of two. So maybe I'll only do two in here. And then the dogs have got a bed, like wherever they may wish. I, I would doubt very much that they'll stick to them. So we'll do that. Um, we'll keep it quite minimal in here and clean. Keep it, um, but with everything that they may need, we'll get in a few little doggy toys in here. Maybe we could use the bigger ones, actually. Um, no, we'll use this one. Does it matter? Does it actually matter? I wouldn't imagine it does. So we'll just use this one. Stunning. Stunning, stunning. Um, doesn't really need a curtain on there. It's, it's just for the dogs. It is just for the dogs. So we've got a doggy bed there. Maybe I could put a couch in here as well. We'll put a little a little love seat in. So they have got a choice to, whether they want to come up and whiffle on top of a, a love seat. And um, we need one that's going to look a little bit comfy. Like a dog wouldn't mind sitting on it. <laughs> um, Maybe like... Mm, it needs to be a bit softer. Oh, we could use a three-seater in here. So that's good to know. So we'll do that. Maybe using the university three-seater. Because that's quite a big boy. And I could get it in like a, a darker. Yes, we'll do that. Yes. Yes, and what I'm going to do is there does need to be a robot vacuum up here so i'm gonna get a a robot vacuum up here and in here as well oh no robot to be seen though so a robot on every level stunning just in case you don't know what these dogs could get up to do you so just in case there we go oh lovely yes and a nice rug a big rug in here just in case again you don't know whether they're going to wee or not, do you? So maybe... Oh, I don't want to use anything ugly, though. <laughs> we still need to... We still need it to be pretty. Is that going to, like... I thought that was going to glitch through the uh, dog beds, then. We'll do it there, and we'll just plonk it in that orientation like that. No, I don't really like that in here. No, I'm not for that. I'm going to find a rug. There we go. I've just touched up the place a little bit. So I used the big grey fluffy rug. I sized this one up. Uh, put this at a jaunty angle. This portrait here I would imagine being Eleanor's father back in World War One. Um, all what dog loves dog lovers run through the family in the in the Hickenbottom family. Um, this here is obviously going to be playing classic music for the dogs. I mean, I don't even need to question that. And I'm gonna actually put a curtain up here, I think. Am I? Am I? What about if I size it down? No, that's going to look weird. Uh, no, we'll keep it open. It's fine. It's fine. Right, okay. Right, we'll get on to what is going to be Eleanor's kind of, not office, but somewhere where she can come sit down on a computer and deal with all of her finances because she has got a lot of finances. Um, as you can see, I've thumped her money off as well. That was just going down to far too much for Eleanor's liking. and She was not here for it. Not here for it at all. So this is her share of her husband's wealth. But it's also her wealth as well. She is a business lady. So she can make her own money. But is that the right orientation there? I did want to put it there. But I was thinking it might be in a way the door a little bit. I know. It's all right, actually. I think as soon as I put a chair on that, it'd be fine. Um, I am thinking maybe just going full out dark here. In fact, we're kind of out in the open now, so I will keep it a lighter aesthetic going out here. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, office chair. I do really like this chair. I do really like this chair, so I might use this one, you know. It is a very Eleanor chair, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know, Aiden, is it? Is it? Um, And a little lap... No, not a laptop, a full... Fully fledged PC in here as well. Definitely. Um, she would definitely have like lots of orders and stuff. So maybe having a box of her clients. Um, 
receipts and invoices and whatnot. So, where are you? I could use one of you as well. Yeah, we'll use one of you. But I did want that bigger one, like the file one. Where are you? Come to me. Oh, God, I hate searching for all of these. I really do. Okay, so I, I pulled out the actual um, kind of filing cabinet instead and put a lamp there. I just think it makes a bit more sense. She's probably got lots of clients. Lots of clients. She's very successful. Beautiful florist. She really is. I've just thought we've not even given her like a florist, like a flower arranging table anywhere. We're going to have to fix that. I will definitely get one in just because it makes sense for her character, doesn't it? Doesn't it just? Um, Maybe we can put dog breed poster up here. I know it's not going to fit in with the aesthetics, but she enjoys her dogs. She really does. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that for Eleanor. It's only right. It really, it really is. Um, I'm wondering at what to put here. I'm thinking maybe some seating. Maybe a little love seat out here. We could bring in another hound's tooth sofa from this from the downstairs, couldn't we? Yeah, let's do that. We'll flop that into the corner there. Yes. Yes, we'll do that. We'll flop that into the corner. I enjoy it. And we'll do a little a little rug just by the front door to wipe their feet on when they come in. We'll size that down. That's a bit excessive. A bit excessive, that. In fact, I'm going to... Hmm, I do want a plant out here as well. Kind of want it in this corner. So maybe I'll get rid of that. <laughs> After all of that, we're like, let's get rid of that. Not for it. Um, and just a nice big, nice plant. Maybe I could put a chair there instead of a love seat. That could work. So I'll put the plant there. And we'll do a nice little chair in the hound's tooth. Just there, look. Oh, that's cutting into the wall. Yes, that's pretty. Yeah, I enjoy that. I do. I might move this, though. Just there. That's better. Oh, yes. Yeah, that's cute. Yeah, that's cute. Yeah, we like that. So cute. Um, I'll do a on-speed off of camera. Let me just see these timings here. I think this is where we'll stop today's episode, my loves. This part. Um, We've got one more floor left to do, haven't we? But, yeah, that's pretty cute. Let's have a little look, shall we? See what we've done. This is Eleanor's master suite. I do enjoy it. I love that fireplace. I do enjoy that fireplace. It's very nice. Okay, and then you come round to her little makeup area. She's got her own little dressing room with a Nestle Toulouse furniture piece in there. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, lovely. Lovely, lovely. Obviously, we've got the little doggy bedroom as well. A little office and we have finished the basement of debauchery as well which is absolutely gorgeous yes we are here for it very much am so tomorrow um it's going to be the last part of hook and bottom house i know it's going to be the last part i've put a bed up here for the meantime just because the butler didn't have anywhere to stay so we'll do the guest room we'll finish off the butler's area um, and we'll do both of the hallways. So I'll do this hallway and this one in that part as well. Um, and then we are going to be, we'll go into, I'm going to save it first. I'm going to go into map view because I want to show you the ideas of what I've got for the rest and for what I have got for the rest of the lots that we've got left. I reckon that was the worst sentence I've ever said in my life. I have no idea why I said it that way. <sighs> I'm very sorry. Very sorry. Right, please save. Here we go. Let's let's have a look at the map view that we've got going on here. Um, because we've got one more re um one more residential lot that I'm going to be moving a family into that will have ties kind of everywhere. But we've also still got these two to do. This one here is going to be a British pub. I definitely want to do a British pub. Um, and this one here, we were going to do like a a community kind of space with it's going to have a club, like a nightclub, but it's also going to have um, outside space for people. Obviously, I'm going to be making like a 
stage area. I might even do the stage area in the pub as well because I do want this, these two to have like drag shows and whatnot. Um, but then that is Newcrest built. That would that's going to be us finished. That is going to be us complete and done. We're going to be moving on to something else. And I'm going to go through everywhere. And I'm going to make sure that I've got all bios and everything. Just going over the characters. And it's going to be good. It is going to be good. I'm very much looking forward to it. Yes. Okay. Well, I'm going to leave you here. Thank you so much for tuning in. As always, leave me some comments in below. And I will try to get to every single one like I normally do. Um, but yeah, I will see you tomorrow, friends. Bye-bye.